Hey everyone, Technomancer here with a video for you guys. Now, if iOS 26 beta update is not showing up on your iPhone, you want to follow these steps to get it. So let's get started. The very first thing it's really common is that you want to make sure your phone is a compatible device. So the ones that are currently compatible with iOS 26 beta, it's going to be iPhone second generation SC or newer and iPhone 11 or a newer device. If you have anything lower than that, like the iPhone 10, 10s, 10R, they are not supported. Anything older than that, of course, is not supported. So make sure you have a newer device, iPhone SE second generation or newer, or the iPhone 11 or newer device. Now, once you have that, the next thing you want to check out is that your phone has good charge here. If your charge is low, you're not going to be able to get the update. So make sure you charge up your phone. And you also want to be on the latest iOS 18 update. So in your settings, go to general software update if there is the ios 18 update which is 18.5 you want to update to that first before getting into beta now another thing you want to do is if you haven't joined the beta program you need to enroll in that you can go over to a browser like safari and then go to beta.apple.com and then here you're going to go ahead and sign up with your same apple id that you're using on your iphone here so it has to be the same apple id so you can actually receive beta so you're going to click on sign up and then follow the prompt. So you're gonna, as you can see here, just sign in. I'm gonna enter the code here. And then once you're signed in, you're gonna basically agree to the terms and conditions here to get into the beta program. Now, once you have done that, you make sure the same Apple account here. You're gonna also make sure you have a good strong Wi-Fi works the best. Cellular isn't the greatest, so we want a strong Wi-Fi connection. And then along with that, you wanna go into settings general, and then date and time, make sure your date and time is set correctly to your local zone. You can manually set it here, but again, you wanna always ensure that it's set correctly automatically. Now, after you have done that, the next thing you wanna do is to go into your settings and then general software update and the beta update update here, you wanna go ahead and make sure your Apple ID is signed in. If you're on another beta like 18, you wanna switch over to 26 so here and then turn off right if you don't see it off and on go back it should show up now if it doesn't again switch off and then go back and then keep on doing this a few times until you see the 26 a beta update now if you're still not seeing the beta update here the next thing you want to do is in the settings general and then iPhone storage. You wanna make sure you have enough storage available on your iPhone. So generally it's about 10 gigs that you need. So if you don't have 10 gigs available, you wanna delete some apps, videos, photos, anything to clear up space on your iPhone. And then after you have done that, the next thing to do if it's still not showing up is in your settings, go to general, then scroll down where it says transfer reset iPhone. Click on the first reset and we're going to reset the network settings. So you can enter the phone's passcode. And what a network where settings will do is just basically reset the network settings like the Wi Fi that you have set. But it is something you'll need to do in order to troubleshoot. Now, if you did all of this, the next thing you want to do if it's still not working is quickly press and release the volume up, volume down, then hold on to the side button until the screen goes completely black and the Apple logo appears. So I quickly press and release volume up, volume down, and then hold on to the side button just like that. And all we're doing is waiting for the phone to completely shut down and the Apple logo to reappear on the screen before we let go of that side button. So as you can see here, let go. Now this will not delete any of your data, completely safe to do. Again, all you're doing is quickly pressing and releasing volume up, volume down, one after another quickly and holding on to the side button. If it doesn't work the very first time, just keep on trying it, it should work for you. And again, once you're back on, you're gonna go back into your phone. And then another thing to check out is in your settings, in general, if you have a specific VPN or device management that can be blocking that update. So you wanna turn off that VPN from it or if you have any device management you need to turn those off before you can check out the beta update now let's say you did all of this and still not showing up 
uh, just go ahead and try it in a bit. Sometimes it takes the Apple server a little bit, depending on what region you're in, for the update to show up. So what you're going to do is go back into this. Just keep uh, trying to check on and off with the other version of beta that you have. And again, tap on your Apple account here just to make sure there's nothing you have to hit and agree. And that should do it for you. I hope this video was helpful. If so, please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks. We'll see you guys next time.